Hi, I'm Ginger Snacks, and today I'm going to be showing you the seeds I ordered from Pure Pollination. I'd never heard of Pure Pollination before, but I kept getting ads that popped up for their company, and they were running a sale on seeds. This pack that I bought is their 40 most popular heirloom seed varieties, and it was on sale for $25. Let's open it up and see what's inside. So it looks like most of the seeds come in these little tiny metal containers and they're labeled what they are. Um, there are a couple that are not though. Like this Wonder Pepper, uh, Romaine, package came with uh, green arrow peas, blue lake bush beans, a uh, bilicious corn, Boston pickling cucumber, yellow Spanish onion, uh, peridovic sunflower, I don't know how to say that. Victoria Rhubarb, it's kind of cool. Mary Washington Asparagus. American Purple Top Rutabaga. Scarlet uh, Carrot. Cherry Bell Radish. Purple Top Turnip. Detroit Dark Red Beet, Jalapeno, Sweet Yolo Wonder Pepper, Sweet Banana Pepper, Cayenne Pepper, uh, Snowball Y Cauliflower, Utah Celery, Calabrese broccoli, beefsteak tomato, Floridad tomato, Long Island Brussels sprouts, spineless okra, summer squash, black beauty eggplant, Sugar pumpkin, crimson sweet watermelon, green flesh honeydew, Hale's best jumbo cantaloupe, giant noble spinach, slowbolt arugula. Large white rib Swiss chard. Georgia Southern collards. Red acre cabbage. Cimarron romaine. Paris Island lettuce. Buttercrunch lettuce, blue scotch curled kale, and iceberg lettuce. These packets are really small. They don't say what the seed quantity is. It gives you no planning information. Uh, it literally just says the variety type and you can't see inside most of them. Uh, so I feel like that's definitely where pure pollination was lacking. It did come with a digital, digital kit guide that I can download. I'm going to pull up the website that they showed me and we can go through it together and hopefully it gives me a little bit more information about the plants that were included in this because I don't want to look up each one individually. 
If you look at other seed companies like Baker Creek Heirloom, this is one of their seed packets. On the back it tells you when it was packaged, uh, the minimum seeds that are in it, what year it was packaged for, a little bit of information, um, planning instructions, how long it takes to sprout, ideal temp, um, and these give me absolutely nothing. Here's the back of that. So we'll pull up this website and we'll see what information it gives us. I pulled up Pure Pollination's website and I can view everything that's in this variety kit. It says in total there are 16,500 seeds in 40 different varieties. And I can scroll down and it shows me the quantity for every variety. I was also given a link to Pure Pollination's instruction booklet. And this does provide a lot more information about the seeds. It has their mission statement. It gives you some growing guides and germination tips. And I can scroll through this page by page and it gives me details about each individual plant and different notes and harvesting tips. Thanks for watching my video. Uh, if you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe. Uh, down in the comments below, I want to know if you tried any new seed companies this year and what your experience with it was. Uh, if anybody's tried out pure pollination, have you planted the seeds? Do you like them? Did you have success? Thanks for watching.